So I just got done, um, you know, with, with my nephew's tennis match, and it went good. Um, they were playing a, a a stronger school um, the, the overall, so I don't know that the my nephew's school is going to take the win today, but I thoroughly enjoyed watching him play. And I'm on my way now. I'm going to spend a couple of nights with my parents again, as you know, the dementia factor. Um, I was able to visit with my sister today also um, because my nephew, her son, right, tennis match, and she was there. And she and I are discussing, all right, how hard is it going to be when the time comes to take the car keys away from, uh, from, my, from our dad, right? And so um, he's fine right now. He's still good. But we know that if the Lord, if the Lord doesn't come back beforehand or whatever, you know, that time's going to, is going to get there, you know, so, um, but yeah, I just praise the Lord for, you know, yes, this world's crucified, but does that mean that we can't enjoy going out and doing things and that we can't enjoy hobbies? No, enjoy your hobbies, play the piano, throw those batons, hit, you know, hit tennis, you know, enjoy um, just doing recreational sports or whatever it is that you enjoy doing because we do have to live in this world. We are in the world, even though we're not of the world. We just keep in mind that in the back of our mind that yes, we know it's crucified, but we still enjoy those things while we're here. We just don't find our identity in those things. But the Lord does want us to enjoy different things and have fun and you know, when this, that, and the other, and laugh. He wants us to laugh, and he just wants us to have fun, and as we rest in him, and as we rest in him, we can enjoy those things even more. Um, so anyway, all right, guys, be blessed.